Welcome! Today's subject is how to adjust the knobs of a sniper rifle scope. You will need four things. A scope that doesn't use the vanilla zeroing, a rangefinder, a weather tracker, and a ballistic calculator. Keep in mind that the class names of those items can be found in the description below. Our target is over there. The first thing you want to do is to find a good place to be prone without any inclination. To see if you're ok, press Ctrl, Shift and K to open the protractor. Like you can see, it's set to zero, which means there's no inclination. The ballistic calculator will tell you how to set the knobs on your scope depending on the information given by your weather tracker and your rangefinder. Open the weather tracker with ACE. Click on the top or down arrow until the user screen 2 appears. This tells you the temperature, the pressure and the humidity. We need to put this information in the ballistic calculator. Before opening that, show the weather tracker. Then open the ballistic calculator. Select atmosphere, TBH for the calculating method and enter the values from the user screen too. Click on done when you are finished. Now we need to select the right caliber in the ballistic calculator. Select gun list. When you have chosen the right caliber, click on done. It is time to enter data about our target in the ballistic calculator. I suggest you take notes somewhere to make this easier for you. Press Shift and K to see the direction of the wind. Grab your rangefinder, aim at the target and press Tab to find the range. Open the weather tracker to get the direction of fire. You also need to calculate the wind speed. To do this properly, choose it with the weather tracker, close it, show it with ACE, and face the direction of the wind. Open the ballistic calculator, choose target, and enter the values from the weather tracker and your rangefinder. You can ignore the other fields. Click on done when you are finished. We are done collecting data and the knobs can be adjusted. The elevation contains the parameters for the top knob. The wind contains the parameters for the side knob. Press on page up and page down to change the zeroing of the top knob. To make this faster, hold shift. To change the zeroing of the side knob, hold control. Press C to stabilize your gun.
at this distance there is a high chance to fail the shot. You need to observe where your bullet lands to make proper adjustments. Aim at the center mass of the target, hold right click to hold your breath, and fire. To hit the target, you have two choices. You can compensate for the wind by aiming accordingly with the mill dots or adjust the knobs. To complete this tutorial, I will talk about the modules I've used. I used advanced ballistics and wind deflection. Do not use ace weather. There are issues with the wind when this module is in effect. So, do not include this in your missions. Thank you for watching.